Look at that sunrise. What are you doing yoga? I'm stretching. So guys, we're here downstairs by the lovely dining area and we're gonna have breakfast. Yeah. So we're gonna see what they have. Some stuff already starts coming out. So we're waiting for the bread to come out and then we will enjoy some breakfast here before we head out on the road. Well, yeah. we have something exciting that you wanna do. Yeah. <laughs> Coffee and tea station here. Some different condiments here. Butter, sugar, salt, Nutella. Got some orange juice. Some vegetables, pineapples, what's called that? Watermelon. We have a granola and cereal dispenser. We got chicken, sausage. Mmm. We also got some fried fish. And we got Lovey's favorite scrambled eggs. <laughs> Here's the bread. Oh, it's big. Coconut big. Some cheese. Oh, yeah, it's a pancake. If you want some pancakes. So this is my breakfast. I have fish, eggs, coconut beef and regular sliced bread with my butter, my bowl of fruits and cocoa tea. And this is my food. Yeah, some nice fried fish, toast bread, piece of coconut beef, some eggs, cheese, orange marmalade. Never tried before. I think I'm gonna try the fish with that. Some butter and cocoa tea. Oh, I gotta get a bowl of fruits. So guys, we're gonna enjoy all those bread here. Mm, okay. Alright, so we're gonna eat up and we we'll catch you guys on the road. Of course, we'll be not eating marmalade. What do you know about that? <laughs> Love trying new things, huh? Sometimes. Yeah. Hey, this fish is cooked up with perfection. Good. So this is king fish. I like it fried in some really nice breadcrumbs. It's really tasty. Okay guys, we believe we are here and Lovey is going to ride horses. So we are here in the village of Buku and we're here by Healing Horses. Healing with Horses 13th anniversary. This is the entrance. Oh, you want more love? Hello. What's your name? Simba. Simba. Somebody. Oh wow. It is really nice. Beautiful. Hey boy! who lives here now mm -hmm. this is Apollo Apollo is now with us uh, since 2018 he is favorite horse of all the volunteers oh, mm -hmm. nice and he um, came to us very skinny I thought no adult can ride him when he came out of the trade and look at him now do some of your horses this do horseback riding like racing on your traps Dulce Dama did She's now six years That's old. She came with us to us when she was three years old. And she um, looks beautiful now. She looks like a little beach bum. Oh. Very long hair. <laughs> and when she came, she had very clipped hair. You know, this is Shavari at the grazing land. So we are very fortunate that the horses are grazing every day before no man's land, 20 acres. Okay. So after the session, we bring the horses back to the beach and they go behind the beach grazing. And at 5.30, 
on the dot, if you go to the beach, the horses walk by themselves back home. It's amazing. Wow. I really would love for you to see that. That is like <laughs> only in Tobago you can yeah. see that. And the villagers know that they're coming back and they would tell the tourists, yes, these are, they live up at the park, you know. And in the back we have Winston, the miniature pony walking. Mm. Oh, that was so nice. Cute. So even the local people who are really afraid of horses, you know, they would get to fall in love with the horses because of that little one. <laughs> so when I came here with horses in 2007, the first horse, Jennifer, people sometimes changed the side of the road. They were really disliked, this white lady with that horse, you know, through Princess Julie, who was born by us in 2008, a foal. Basically, we win the hearts of the people in the village, you know. And then when Winston came to us in 2013, then people really started to like horses. I mean, he is adorable. Uh -huh. <laughs> he has a mind of his own, right? <laughs> so, of course, all the horses have a mind of their own. Just like we, we are all, like you know. Like a dog running with yours. <laughs> so this is Morning Calm. He is now um, 11 years old. He is the first horse who came to us healthy, fit. But uh -huh. he had a mindset. He didn't go in the starting gate anymore. Uh -huh. And this is Mucha Helos. She's from Florida. She's also a really good swimmer. So for these pictures, we took them out to Grange Beach, which has very, very clear waters. Ella rode most of these horses already. Or is there one horse you didn't ride? Well, Winston, because you were just <laughs> always too big for Winston. <laughs> she never was written before she came to us, but um, she was a broodmare. So she um, had lots of foals and the last five foals there. She had miscarriages. That's why they didn't watch her anymore. So, you know, it's like me. I have a second chance here as a horse lover. I created my own second chance. And now I, I share my passion and you can feel the horses really love what they're doing. And this is Princess Judy, oh, the only nice horse which picture. was one by us. The most laziest one. Jennifer mm -hmm. was, I think she was the first horse. Yes. Here. Um, she mm -hmm. passed away this year, I think. Mm -hmm. She was there for 15 All years. Right. Got a gift, guys, calendar. Yeah. She booked online. We have an online booking calendar. Cool. Very okay. nice. <laughs> so let's go. Uh, you can already go and take a, a bridal. Yeah. Oh, nice. One? Uh, yeah. Black one, brown one. I don't know. Actually, anyone. Brown one. Yeah. There's a mirror. Like a little tear in it too. Also a red makes one. it real genuine. You what? <laughs> little tear in it. Makes it like real yeah. genuine, now, like like it's been used. It's <laughs> That's yeah. nice. Do you know they'll take off the shoes. What do you mean? We don't go on yeah, horses with the shoes. Nice. No, you go barefoot, really? Yeah. Oh, and we we left so home and then forgot her shoes home and went back for it. Not know. Really, the shoes. Yeah. Wow. So, I would like to introduce our beautiful tour this morning with a lovely picture. That picture was taken in 2010, long time ago, 13 years ago, when we only had five horses. Now, I would like you to guys to know that horses are actually herd animals. There is a daddy horse in the herd, like Mr. Shivari, he's the leader, he's very brave. So wherever he goes, the other horses go. And then we have his follower, his sister, half-sister, Kalakunjin. She's 25 now. She mm. just goes where he goes. She's so shy. <laughs> and then we have a very, very lazy horse, Miss Princess Julie. She's the only <laughs> horse which was born by us. <laughs> so that's Jennifer's daughter. So she left Princess Julie with us. And that's Jennifer, the one who was living in the rainforest for six years behind Blue Waters in Starwood, Charlotteville. This is Mr. Devo. He came from the racetrack in Trinidad. So each horse has a personality. I need you guys to know that not all horses like to swim deep. Like I never went diving, even I lived here since 17 years, mm -hmm. but I just don't feel like. And I think this ties us back to our NGO. We are all differently abled. Mm -hmm. We have different hobbies. We are different people. We have different abilities. Everybody's great, but different. Yeah. Yeah? Mm -hmm. So this is Rajesh Dobal at Triple Empathy. All of you guys are here because he's supporting healing and being with horses in some way. Because of you guys, we can do what we're doing, the NGO. So Triple Amputees, he's a young man on the autism spectrum. So you're our sponsors. I need to say that, yeah? yeah. I need to mention that. Thank you guys for coming here, yeah? You know, our best clients are actually <laughs> Trinis. Really? So. Uh -huh. And I love that nice. because, you know, we, I'm gonna have a little challenges with that lady because she rides horses. And when you <laughs> learn riding in Germany, you always click, click. Yeah, so put yourself in the horse's place. 
<laughs> so, you know, the horses she rode, yeah. When I was a horseback riding instructor in Germany, I had about 25 different bits, you know, according to how spirited my horse is, you know. The thinner the bit is, the more sharp it is, you know. That was the Frisian stallion I rode in, in the horse musical. He was ri written with a pelham. This is a jumping, you know, bit. So now I say, it's the bond, it's the relationship. When you get a new dog, you know, of course the mm. dog will not go by foot the first day, you know, but after three months, he will, right? Okay, and Inky wants to be adopted. Mm -hmm, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh. And then we show you how we hold the reins and we guide the horse and then we're gonna go riding through the village, along the wetland, along the mangroves for a long beach ride and then we go swimming. And if you have okay. questions, there's my husband Lennon, like mm -hmm. John Lennon, <laughs> um, there's Shaheem, yeah, and myself, we are there and we make sure that you feel well, Thanks. yeah, okay. and if there is anything you're concerned, please let me know, alright? Excited? came to us when she was three years old. Emma, how old are you today? Nineteen. Wow, <laughs> nineteen. That's really old. <laughs> you don't look like that. <laughs> she doesn't look like nineteen. <laughs> and we are so grateful that you spent this morning with us. And um, we would like to give you something special from the horses. Your favorite color. Aww. And we would like to sing happy birthday for you. Let's hold our hands and put Emma in the circle. Can you take a video? And Cosi, can I hand, <laughs> hold your hand? Cosi, sweating, strong man. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Emma. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday! Gonna Come get, here for a gonna get to meet the horses and let the horses Thank choose you. them because you can't choose your horse, it needs to feel comfortable with you. Beautiful. Stretch your hand out now. That's why the horse is coming to you. You know, you just play. <laughs> nice. Things, yeah? You very have to let nice. the horse know what you want. You're on video, you know, you're on YouTube. You can't be on YouTube like this. <laughs> Alright, good. You come to walk a horse. <laughs> nice one. So, what's your name? What wonderful name mommy gives you? Butterflies? Miss. Lovey? Miss. Oh, no. Miss. 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 oh my Miss. Miss. goodness! Yeah. So Princess yeah. Julia loves yeah. too. Yeah. Eh? So now let's get this thing going. So today we have two princesses. Now when you have two princesses fighting for supremacy, mm -hmm. it does work. <laughs> it does work and you are a princess or a queen? I'll go to queen. Why ain't see no grey hair you're dying or what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very much. So now let's go to the mountain block. Come on princess. Okay. Come, Princess. So, really and truly, today is first time riding a horse? Yes. Nah, man, I can't. So, you have a stallion? You have a stallion at home? A German Shepherd? No. <laughs> who is this? Who is this here? <laughs> <laughs> that stallion? 
sit on your butt and goes with the flow of the horse. And you born through that and the big, right? Yeah. So you're born in wine. You can still wine. Now, if you cannot wine, I have some snake oil from salt. <laughs> now she can wine. Okay, good. Okay. You see that? You're stallion. You're stallion. <laughs> All right. All right, good. Action. We have left, we have right, we have stop, and we have walk on. Taking the reins. I love how you're handling the reins. I watched our western last night. All right. I love your wolf too. You have a nice wolf there. Who is that wolf? My dog. Oh, <laughs> is that husky? All right. So now, right here. This is your information. This is your position at all times. When you need your information, you use it. When you don't use it, you put it back. It's like leaving the fridge door open. Use it, put it back. It's like leaving the toilet seat open. Use it, put it back. as how you get it. You pull for stop and you go for go. Okay. See that? Let's go. Easy like that. Left is left, right is right. You pull on both of them to stop and a soft rate to hold. <laughs> he has a mind of his own. Oh, look at him, pony. Normal Trini girl, yeah, see big horse, they get scared. Yeah. <laughs> how the mom, how the pops? Are they in that? Okay, good. How the partner? How the AC? Matthew, know the damn thing. <laughs> Trying to do the walk and wine. Yeah, yeah, walk on, girl. Yeah, let's take Yeah, walk on. Walk on. What are we doing with all that speed out? You have to get in. I'm loving it. You can't keep full ticket until you go. Alright, Alaska. You're getting a full cardio today. Yeah. Alright. Alright, so today's cardio day today, my um, lovey is doing being with horses, swim train. Mm -hmm. You want to find us more? You can go on healing or being with horses or trip advisor. Trip advisor, mm -hmm. that's why I They will advise you how we do what we do. Alright? And, and you all can always leave a review for us because this is how we get the people on trip advisor. Nice right, man. That's lovey. Yeehoo! Oh, she's great. Yeah, call girl X. Mm hmm.
go on, girl. Princess, walk on. I'm gonna go in the water. Yeah, you have to get in order for her to understand your signals. You have to sit upright. This is loose and this is tight. 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 Click. 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 So relax your legs. Sit upright. You can do it. You are this amazing Jenny lady. You're sexy. Show me, girl. Click. 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 With a smile. I know it's a lot of work. Very good. Very good. Very good. Left wrist short, right wrist long, and hold right hand in the hand in the side. So shorten up your left, lengthen the right long as possible, and then you hold it with your right hand between the side. And go you that full left long. Pull left like you long. Pull left. Left. Your right foot will be used because you're going to swim now. You just pull left lovey. Pull left like you in love. Your right should not be used because you're looking to swim now. Ah. So your left shall be more used. Come on, princess. Love it. Smile and wave. <laughs> to get her to move faster. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Why do you make any noises? It's because they're singing, like they're singing, because they're enjoying it. Okay, she wants to go. Nice. 
Oh, Izzy, Izzy, Izzy. Stay here, Boop. Stay here. You're doing great. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, hey. Hey, Okay, so we're back. We all washed up and cleaned up. The weather took a turn for the worse. The sky, the whole sky turned grey. The whole place got dark. On our ride back here to Castara. Lovey thoroughly enjoyed those healing horses. That was how, real fun. How was the full experience? <laughs> it was worth the money. Yeah, how much was it though? 100 US. For like about two and a half hours. Yeah. It was two and a half hours then. Yeah. yeah. And learning, this was her first time riding a horse. Yeah, it was real fun. Yeah, was it what you thought yeah. or was it harder? It was harder. <laughs> it looked so easy on videos and pictures, but um, I got a feel about a feel about it. So if I do it again next time, I'll be know what to do. Yeah, should be easier. Yeah, because yeah. there's a lot of things that you have to remember and to do and not to do. Yeah. Because the horses are very sensitive and you have to gain their trust. Yeah. Cause she got the most stubborn horse and yeah, everybody the every most <laughs> stubborn horse I get and the, the horse name is Princess <laughs> <laughs> what? oh my gosh but, but it was around nice yeah so it's almost like um it's almost like Avatar the movie where they have to like pair with her avatar yeah. <laughs> they had to pair with their horses because you can't go to the horse you have to let the horse come to you so you have to like sit and call the name and and the horse will come to you and and you gotta get low because <laughs> if you're too tall the horse is gonna you know feel intimidated and it's not gonna come to you but I was on the sideline admiring and just looking on and filming and it was a great experience for me as well because I, I learned a lot and I mean healing horse Horses. They they have a very good organization and and they help and facilitate people who are autistic. You know, any any people any person who needs that kind of mental healing should go come in Tobago here yeah, and ride those horses because that's what it's all about. And I mean, the money goes towards also maintaining the horses because it's not cheap. It's a really nice experience, and I think Lovey's all healed. <laughs> 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 it yeah. was a very fun experience. I enjoyed it. Well, the weather's kind of sucky, so we're just gonna lay low here and just okay, relax. It's holding up now. Yeah, it's holding up now. I wanted to get any water, but after I bathed there, I'd feel it so clean. I don't know if I want to go in our water again. <laughs> if the sun come out and blaze for some reason, well then yeah, might think about it. Uh, in the morning, we're supposed to do some fishing, so let's look. Let's hope that we get some fish tomorrow. Huh? Please. Please. <laughs> We could easily buy fish, eh? but it's just so much fun to catch your own food fresh from the ocean and cook it yourself. I guess you guys will see what we're up to next. Uh -huh, they have a little rock here, we gotta swim around the rock and go to the little bay there. But I saw somebody rubbish here. We'll get that after. They also have some friendly stingrays in this water.
surprised if it would be pair of guys. <laughs> right here. There's a more trip to my only rock. They have some fishes on any there too. It was nice. As always guys, conserve the environment and keep your oceans clean. This bottle was out there in the water and I tossed it here. So I'll come back for it, so I'll throw it away. Well, that's a wrap today for our dinner guys. Just whipped up some sweet potatoes and some mixed veggies here. Woo, you're looking golden girl. And we're just going to enjoy our dinner here while looking at this beautiful sunset. Look at how amazing that is. Wow. That's beautiful. So if you guys don't see us, right? <coughs> Food too spicy? <laughs> so if you guys don't see us later, we'll catch you guys in the morning, right? Yeah. Take care, guys. Enjoy it. Enjoy the sunset. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh guys, look at this sunset. Oh wow. That is beautiful. Really, really spectacular. Wow. Probably could not have gotten a better sunset here at Kistara Beach, Tobago. Look at those colors.